Hi guys, so um, it's the weekend and this is really usually when I put a style on my hair if I'm going to do one for the week. Last week I did an updo and I got tons of compliments on it and so I'm going to keep trying to continue to come up with new ideas and I just thought of an, a new one. Um, what I plan to do, I've sectioned my hair off in this curved section to start with. I'm going to flat twist this section back and then I'll cut it back on um, when I'm ready to show the rest. Okay, as you can see, I have the first um, one-fourth of my hair done. I just did flat twist um, on this side. I try to do them as neat and tight as possible, though my hair just puffs up, you know, when I take them out. Um, my hair is in four sections. Um, I have a curved part here. And that was the first section. It's also separated um, across the middle. So I have four sections. The front, back section, and back sections, and then the front one. And now I'm about to do the front one. Um, I'm separating um, on the crown of my head. I'm going to do flat twists forward. Um, and after I do these flat twists forward, um, I'm probably going to have some loose around the edge because I'm going to be creating a French roll. So you'll see that when I get done. Okay, so I just finished the um, the first, uh, the second uh, quadrant of my hair. Um, I just did flat twist going forward. Then I took, I left a small section to make individual flat twists. And then I just took the other flat twist in the front, um, rolled it backward. Um, pinned it as I rolled it backward and just so it wouldn't um, come a loose. Then I took the remaining hair and I just um, pin, uh, pinned it into the already the roll I had in the first from rolling the first um, twist. And I just took the ends and tucked them and pinned it. So now what I'm about to attempt to do is um, this my whole back half of hair is loose. So, what I'm going to do is um, flat twist going towards the left and have open twist, he, um, individual twist here. And I have these pinned for now, but I don't plan on keeping it like that. Either I'm going to take the op individual twist and pin them with this, um, with this um, twist or a roll or whatever. Or I'm just going to take these out, take them down, and have the individual twists hanging with them. So we'll see. I'm about to go ahead and finish up this back section. Okay, so um, the only section I have left to do is the, um, the open section that I left to do individual twists. I'm going to try to show you the back. I'm always very bad at showing the back of my hair because I hold the camera, but I'm going to try. So I just did flat twists individually. I meant, um, not individually, from right to left, and the left one hanging. Hopefully you can see this. Okay, and I'm about to do the um, individual twist, and then I'm going to show you how I'm going to finish styling the rest of my hair. Okay, so I'm done doing the individual twist, and I let down the ones I had in the roll. Um, I've decided I want to protect my end. So I'm just going to take all my twists and um, just roll them up. Okay, I'm done with everything. This is the finished look. I had to get on the floor because, like I said, I don't have a camera stand. But this is the only way you can see it, like um, a pretty good view of it. But this is the front and side. And like I said, it's did French rolls and rolled them up for a big flat twist however you want to look at it um, and this is the back I just flat twist it over and then pin them up and that's it and this is just going to be my protective style for the week and I hope you enjoyed um, this hairstyle in the my little mini tutorial thanks for watching bye